I am very fortunate to call Northern Vermont my home. I am surrounded by material from which to draw much inspiration for my paintings. Steps from my studio, I'm in a lovely landscape with meadows, views into Canada, a wonderful garden, and a beautiful pond. With the COVID challenges and isolation of 2020, the pond has been a place for quiet and calm in an otherwise unsettling time. When I work with a new subject, I want to understand as much as I can about an area before attempting to put paint to a surface. For me, this means direct observations, photo references, taking some time for plein air sketches, and even black and white pencil sketches. All of these aspects of putting a painting together are vital for my process, especially when working towards larger formats. The beautiful evenings in summer and autumn are some of my favorite moments in this area of the property. I love the late day light streaming through the trees and the different colors of the sky which change moment to moment and are never the same twice. I find these dusky scenes so rich with color and mood, but very difficult to paint. After several studies, smaller paintings, and many hours of trial and error, I finally felt up to the challenge of putting together a larger format for this subject. The final result is the painting, The Still Hush of Evening. I'm happy to share with you I entered this painting into a monthly online competition with Plein Air magazine called Plein Air Salon. Recently, I was notified that the judge for the month of March Lance Reyes of Reyes Gallery in New York awarded this painting first place overall. Almost 1,100 entries were submitted for the March competition. So many were such great pieces. I was truly flabbergasted and very honored to receive this recognition. I'll keep working on this motif from my property here in Vermont. I doubt I will ever get tired of trying to replicate the poetry of this beautiful scene. Thanks for watching.